soy la tierra, la sangre, los sueños, las ganas, el hambre, la luz en los ojos de mi santa madre. Hecho de barro, de rama, de viento, de hueche, de carne, el sol cae en mi brazo por la tarde. Si preguntan quién soy, soy mi tierra, cutita de gobierno, de estafa, de guerra. Soy el hornero mostrando la sala, la vida, la muerte, la pluma y la bala, la soledad del rico, el sueño del pobre. La verdad de que el gobierno no se esconde, las huellas perdidas, el cuándo y el dónde. Ninguna dictadura va a poder borrar mi nombre, porque al futuro vengo de tierra santa. Latinoamérica no llora, canta. Tengo la sonrisa celeste y blanca, si subo la mirada, la luna se levanta. Yo voy al futuro, vengo de tierra santa. Latinoamericano llora, canta. Tengo una sonrisa celeste y blanca, si subo la mirada, la luna se levanta. Mi cicatriz es mi historia, mi fama, mi gloria, mi pena por pana desaparecido memoria. Va por los guachos, carnales, puñetas, gurises, chapales, al mundo le tiembla el piso por la euforia. Busco la paz en Bolivia, las calles de Chile, me busco en invierno el agua ardiente de Colombia. Vengo del barrio del tango y llego al meridiano para borrar con la mano la línea divisoria. Si preguntan quién soy, que llevo a donde voy, soy de tierra santa, soy de donde nací, donde voy a morir, mi tierra santa. Si preguntan quién soy, si preguntan quién soy que llevo a donde voy, soy de tierra santa. Yo vine al mundo a defender mi tierra, soy del Salvador Pacífico en la guerra, me voy a morir luchando, estoy firme como un venezolano, soy Atacama, Guaranico, Yabadí, Tucano. Si quieren tirarme el país, lo levantamos. Los indios construimos los imperios con las manos. Voy al futuro, vengo con mis hermanos, de diferentes padres, pero no nos separamos. Soy el fuego del Caribe y un guerrero peruano. Le doy gracias a Brasil por el aire que respiramos. A veces pierdo, a veces gano, pero no es en vano morirme por la tierra que amo. Y si los de afuera preguntan cómo me llamo, mi nombre es la y mi apellido americano si preguntan quién soy que llevo a donde voy soy de tierra santa soy de donde nací donde voy a morir mi tierra santa they know what's at stake just a point required to guarantee their passage through to the knockout stage Welcome to southern France. We're at the Stade Vélodrome in the city of Marseille. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got UEFA Champions League group stage action to bring you tonight. It's Olympique de Marseille up against Sporting. Well, Derek, they come here in good form. If they can put in another solid performance today, it should guarantee their... Can he put it away? And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And so Marseille get the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? To Kate Delare. And he has options available. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Well, what a goal that would have been. Surprised he took it on, to be honest. Long way out, but oh, so close. When Duzzi gets with Harit. Vertu. Payet. Amin Harit. Suarez. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Might be a chance here. And foiled only by the crossbar. Ball is loose. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. Well, no card from the referee, Stuart. Well, I think it's good refereeing. He's just letting everybody know who's in charge here. And a timely intervention. Good-looking sequence. Big chance. There is 
is. Two to the good now, and that gives them a buffer. Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. And providing width. Spot on with that tackle. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Luis Javier Suarez has eyes for goal.
Luis Javier Suarez. And I must say, that was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. Useful looking ball. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. The ball rolling again in what has been an utterly one-sided match. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Cross could be useful. It comes to nothing in the end. Is it going to be? Oh, fine stop. And getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Marseille will get the throw in. Now they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Suarez. Really good challenge. Making progress. Can they keep it out? Able to clear the danger, at least for now. And a goal it is! But offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. Well read to win possession back. And a throw-in coming up for Marseille. Luis Javier Suarez. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Simple save, really. Mukoko. Counter attacking, very much an option. There are so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Went in strongly, decisively. And so that is going to be that. The final whistle here, and they're in a pretty comfortable position because not only have they put a place in the knockout stages, it's still... And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the... Well-timed tackle. A 
Well, the free kick needed to be a lot better than that. Charles de Quetelare. He's got the right idea with that pass. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Oh, the threat is there. It's got to be. And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily.
deservedly hold the advantage. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Well, the supporters think it's on. Very straightforward for Hugo Lloris. Harry Kane. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Manuel Ugarte. Well, they've given him too much space. Surely didn't fool the keeper. It might still be problematic. Can they square the game? And it goes! The leveller! Thrilling stuff here. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Kyung Min Son. And Spurs moving the ball with purpose. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Now he must favour the cross. Fabier. Kane! Oh, fine stop. Another short corner here. Shown inside. Can he finish? And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. So on they go again. So back in business here and sporting trailing going into the second half. Will they come up with the right response? Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Just hearing the situation has changed in the Eintracht Frankfurt game. And Alex Scott has the details. It's a goal for Marseille. It was a breathtaking finish. A shot from such a long way. A minute could be in here. Still a chance. And power over subtlety. He's hit the woodwork. Well, he made decent contact with it, but he has to score from that range. Fabier. Ivan Perisic. Well, a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Well, apologies to our viewers for having to interrupt Alex just then. To confirm, Marseille did score in that match, and they now hold a 1-0 lead. A lot to like about this sporting move. This could square the game, and that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. So back underway, dead level, 2-2. No foul, Spurs advantage. Effective challenge. And now, passing it through. Might take the lead. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. On with the game then. 3-2. What will happen next? on and Hoybier with it always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game but you could make a strong case for this man I think Stuart what are you expecting to see from him well he's had a great competition so far his finishing has been so clinical and these defenders just can't afford to give him any sort of space in the box otherwise they'll be punished Well, there it is. The hosts haven't had that much of the ball. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Breaking at pace. A very effective challenge put in. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Not away completely. 
giving it a try. Opportunity. Well, choosing to chip, and it wasn't so very far away. Well, it was good vision, excellent technique, but not quite the end result it deserved. Emerson. And just hearing a goal has gone in in the Eintracht Frankfurt game. Let's hear all about it from Alex Scott. Yep, it's a goal for Eintracht Frankfurt. The score's level again now at 1-1 with 74 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. Bentancourt, superb block. Well, a corner it is and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Trying to pick out a teammate.
goal proved to be. And he could really get at the opposition. Is it going to be? In it goes! Two goals in rapid fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. Well, here's the replay, and I have to say, the keeper's got his angles all wrong there. That's a poor piece of goalkeeping. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Rodrigo Pino. Nicely timed tackle. St. Justa. Now can they make something happen? Pressing high to win the ball. He's beaten his man. Firing it in. Could be. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Keen to take it short here. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Good pressure, can they make something of this? And he's made headway! Defending of the highest class to stop him. Rodrigo Pino. Maxler now. Aursnes. A very effective challenge put in. Brilliant piece of skill. And his teammate got him out of trouble. Oh, big chance. A goal! They're absolutely racing away with this. Three to the good now. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So the game continues. Our Sporting going to stroll to victory. Really good challenge. Aursnes. Musa. Given away by Sporting. Mateus Reis. Ugarte. Braganza. Possession one. Daniel Braganza. And space for him to cut in. And intercepted it. Can they hit on the break? Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Musa. Moving forward effectively. Oh, he's through here. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. So there goes the half-time whistle, and the visitors find themselves behind at the break. Well, we talked at length about their goal-scoring record, but it's been their inability to defend which has stood out today. A lack of communication, not reading danger, and individual mistakes is going to cost them. Unless, of course, they play better in the second half.
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Committed challenge. Daniel Braganza. And they need to get tighter here. Big chance! Oh, it's just over. So unlucky. Well, it's a cheeky attempt, but it just doesn't come down in time. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Braxler. Braxler. Oh, in with a chance. It's gone in. And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, just look at the defending here. The keeper is left totally exposed. It's an easy goal in the end, but well taken. Too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Diogo Gonzalez. And showing fine vision. Well, it nearly worked out. And a fine interception. David Neres. Can he make it count? Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top-class save. Just look how he reacts. Well, the short corner routine. Petar Musa. Oh, he's given the ball away. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. He's in with a chance. Well kept out. But he's gone short with it. Diogo Gonzalez. Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Alexandropoulos. Promising possession, this. And a bad pass it was. 20 minutes to go in this one. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Can he convert? Let's make sure nothing came of that. They take it short. That's a nice-looking ball. Now the attack fizzled out. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. Perfect challenge. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Keen to take it short here. Gilles Dias. Oh, great attacking play. Well, I don't think that effort remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. Right in strongly to win the ball. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. A goal! 
An exceptional performance this. Four to the good now. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Struggling to keep the ball. Looking dangerous here. Great opportunity. What a powerful effort, but just wide. Petar Musa. On the ball is Gilles Dias. Oh, surely. Oh, that's top notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Max Lars. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. And played in, and clears his lines. And that is the end of the contest, and not a happy outcome as far as the visitors are concerned. Well, you can be a great attacking team, as we talked about. But if you... Well, he could really get at the opposition. Is it going to be? 